dreamed about nothing else other than you. I always thought I'd be waiting. Hello, my friends, and welcome. Welcome if you're new. Today, I wanted to give you an updated home tour, um, see how far we've gotten with our renovations. So, I'm going to be starting off with the front hallway and as you can see we have completed all of our floors i have chosen one floor to go from for the whole main floor we have decided to go with luxury vinyl and the floor is called provenza and uh, it's um, modal living and uh, color or the stain or uh, the style it's called finally mine i have also decided to paint the front door i think this just makes it gives it an accent and it makes the front door pop which i really really like i also have individual videos for every single room in detail what we have done uh, and now i'm going to move on to my powder room this one had a in my opinion a big transformation um, however it did not cost a lot i reused all the decor and redid it and then i have just purchased a new sink fa faucet and a countertop as well as a mirror the shiplap that's on the back of the wall was a leftover shiplap from the fireplace because i did shiplap on a fireplace in a living room just to make it look a little bit more custom and oops there's frank's hair everywhere so there's little fuzzies flying everywhere because it's shedding season and they have been shedding like crazy now after from this room we're gonna move on to the mud room and this one had a huge lift facelift as well if you've been following along this was a daycare room um, used for daycare specifically so it was painted bright colors it had name tags it had lots of hooks it was not an adult functioning um, mud room this works much better for us now since both of my kids are young adults and I also utilize this closet for shoes I still want to add maybe a couple more shelves to it uh, but for now it's working as is and now we're gonna we still need to put up uh, the uh, door on the closet and you can see painters tape everywhere which are places where we still have to touch up paint I also finished the stairs I do need to add a trim around the banister and at the front of the stairs as well in this room again the whole main floor got a new paint paint job and like I said I have individual rooms um, detailing everything that we have done and the paint we've used and all that kind of stuff so this is the ship lab that I was talking about from the bathroom this is an electric fireplace and I wanted to make it look a little bit more built in so I had framed it and added ship lab for it to look like it is built in and also this room got the board and batten as well and then we added this accent wall again going with the same black paint that i've painted the other shiplap as well as the front door we still need to finish the electrical covers here because um, like i said all these little things still need to be done and then i also added a fall beam there was a beam there i just dressed it in wood and stained it Uh, and then uh, moving on to my dining room um, this has got a full makeover as well I still want to refinish the table I did refinish the chairs that's a brand new hutch well new to me it is an antique hutch that I thrifted I don't actually know if it's an actual antique but it is a thrifted hutch I should say and as you can see, I also did the stairs going up just to tie everything together. The family room got a paint job and the, t the coffee table got a makeover. I also flipped around the furniture just because I needed it to work a little bit better with the kitchen. 
and then um, I'm, I am I did purchase new couches just waiting for them to come and I think that's gonna all look really good together debating whether I should paint the fireplace or not but um, I'm kind of on the fence and here is the part of the reno that started it all we completely redid the kitchen as you can see it is not done i'm still waiting for the kitchen company to come back and i still need my fridge to come in because that is our garage fridge so i'm just going to give you a little overview i've added some open shelving lots of cabinetry all bottom drawers we still need to get the cabinet uh, door for that corner cabinet need to put up a backsplash a fan needs to go up they need to bring a door for the rest of the pantry the island's pretty much done um i am loving all the extra prep space that i am having on this counter and uh, so my backsplash is here my hoods here i just need the kinship company to come back and finish and put up the crown molding so we can add the backsplash and hang up the hood so here is the view from the kitchen into the rest of the house i am very pleased with the way everything turned out it's been an extremely long process it's still going on and i'm hoping that i will have it all finished by Christmas I'm um, actually I'm hoping I'll have it all finished by the end of September but I'm not holding my breath well I hope you had enjoyed this quick little look at how far we've gotten I will be doing a full kitchen tour and showing you where everything is and how I organize it once the kitchen is fully done so let me know what you guys think and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed and I will see you all in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. When you talk, I think you said enough. You said you love for me something brand new. You said this is something you would never do. Here we are in your car. Let me see who you are. Who you really are. So